So my Iron Man has always neglected doing clue scrolls, and over the past few months I've made a point to complete as many clues as possible. I've played for nearly 20 years, and not even once have I had a glimpse of the mega rare roll on the table. So never mind third age, I've not even had any potions or gilded. And it's about damn time I changed that. <laughs> First of all, let's have a look at the hard clue log. I'm sitting on 79 out of 134 log slots from the standard hard clue drop table. The item I want at the very least is a Zamorok full helm. This is the last item I will need for the master clue steps. This is one of the main drivers why I'm deciding to stack over 1000 hard clues. I've had to leave many masters over the time just because I haven't had this one step completed. So it does only make sense if I'm gonna try and get all these clutch log slots to save up all my hard clues and get them all done in one go. This means if I do get the Zamorak full helm, I can just juggle the steps in between and then get them done once I get the item. Warp Jellies have a 1 in 64 chance to drop a hard clue or 1 in 60 after completing the hard combat achievements, making them the best option for consistent clues on an Iron Man. You'll find the most suitable spot to kill them inside the Karen Catacombs to the south. The fastest, most optimal route for an iron is to run from the Ferring DJR east down the hole and then continue east. You will need a nose peg or sleigh helm as you pass aggressive deviant spectres. So the reality of collecting clues from jellies is it's not that interesting. Besides completing the clues themselves, but it, it does give a fairly good balance between AFK and gameplay. There is two options you can do when killing jellies. So the first option is just to barrage them. If you are a main, you can use ults to lure them in. And it is a fairly common activity to collect tar clues as a main, even though you do have implings as an option. But that obviously does reduce profit. And then you also do have Venator Bowen. Venator Bowen is so AFK. You can just click once every like 20 seconds and it means you can just chill out, watch something on the side, watch a movie and just collect them easily. It is slower, you do probably get about 3 to 4 per hour doing Venator Bowen and Barrage and you, you get closer to 5, maybe 6. Say Bade does say it's 6, I personally don't really get 6 on average, I'd expect more around 5 per hour. Today is update day and the Winter Bingo has just concluded. They've introduced a new drop rate chance for the hard clues in the wilderness for the rogue chests. We're using a ring of wealth imbued. Um, doubles the chances just like other wilderness um, hard clue content which means that they're essentially on par now with doing jellies so I want to show you where I'm up to with my hard caskets now and I'm going to open up all the Skateezo totems that I've done and gather the hard clues from there before moving on and then actually doing the hard clues in the wilderness I've killed a total of what is tracked at least so I have 72,425 um, showing up and the streak is showing lots now so it's more over 65k so um, I'm not too sure na at this point where I'm up to um, comparison but I think it's about 50k that I've gained jellies since then. Moving on to the actual totems I've got about 57 to completed. I, I've left these three aside just so I can confirm which are the ones I already had and the ones I've gained during um, getting the hard clues. I've got a total of 900 um, hard class caskets done. I need to gather another 232. I believe that will get me to my 1500. I did originally say that I was going to go for 1k, but I did change my mind thinking that the within February they're going to do a quality of life change and include an update to include an update to the master clue scrolls where they're stackable just like in leagues. Um, and that means I'll be able to open them all at once and then do hard clues later on. Um, February is typically a quality of life month, at least in the past. I've not seen anything on it just yet, and currently it's Valentine's Day. I'm not too sure if that is going to be introduced. If so, then you'll be finding that straight away, but otherwise, I'll have to be opening these over a day or two, once I do get the further 200 or something. So, from this, I should get a good few elite clue scrolls as well. Um, I'm not too sure the rate. The rate will be on screen right now. And that will add to the elite clues that I've just gained it alongside the hard clues since doing them. No way, hard clue. 
160 pounds soaking wet and didn't receive any college offers. Despite his skill in shooting masterclass, Curry was nowhere to be found on national rankings as a junior. As a senior, his status improved and he Collection was ranked logs as the number 16 no fucking way. Player. That's what. <laughs> hey! That didn't take long. I was expecting to get through quite a few more before I even saw a collection log slot. So in the end, that's left us with just the Dark Totems go after now. Oh, never mind. It's Carl bringing in the stream. You know what, Carl got earlier? Cancer? What the f- Oh, no. What? <laughs> Your first <laughs> guess is cancer. Hmm. <laughs> well, I, I mean, I hope not, but it could be. I mean, you did just play 11 hours a day for five days for bingo. Yeah, but I wasn't smoking the whole time. And you I still wasn't. and you still came eighth. <laughs> right, that was bullshit. Do you know who um, Fit Jamal is, Charlie? Uh, no, I don't believe so. Okay. Carl was looking at the EHBs of the people in the bingo, mm -hmm. like full right. of the bingo. Mm -hmm. What do you get? 92 hours, eight hours EHB. 92 hours, yeah. And it was probably only boosted, like, how many hours? Um, it was probably boosted, like, 10 because of mass in necks and, te um, and eight man TOAs, but... The man got 82 hours EHB in five days. Yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> 17 hours a day. Efficient. Well, pretty standard. Some people take that fucking seriously. Where did That's 17 go? hours a day. Efficient. Yeah, I know. <laughs> they didn't even win. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> wait, 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 is what you look like a guitar? Uh, no, it's a keyboard. So I'm I'm my guitar. No, no, no I was just, I was just showing Abby what I was working on. Actually, yes. rude, I mean. Wait, can I go? Can I show what I was working on? Uh, no. I would love. I would love it. Yeah, I would love, it. Yeah, I would love a Pokeball <laughs> mic from you. Is that Charlie? <laughs> Yeah. Kyle left me before. Kyle got the fucking mole and didn't even show, show me the fucking mole rat version of it, bro. He just left. Yeah, he hasn't changed I it. To he just, exactly. Team. He just fucking dipped. I was like, change it. And he's like, no, fucking bitch. I'm not changing <laughs> yeah, it. No one. I called you a fucking bitch and left. That's exactly what He literally it. did, bro. <laughs> Kyle's like, I bet, I bet he can't do Coop to Gauntlet about the fucking plugins. <laughs> and he fucking left. Didn't even see him get the KC, bro. Yeah, because you didn't. Are you That's pissing? Nah, I'm just giving Bruce some water in his tap. So hey, Charlotte got me hey, some flowers. Like you got some <laughs> <laughs> See? You know, who didn't, you know who didn't get flowers? <laughs> you did <laughs> hear that, Abby? Charlotte gets Harry I've flowers. I've said I would you. get you flowers, but you don't <laughs> care <laughs> about them. That's what Charlotte's mum said the same thing to her. She's like, Harry won't want flowers. <laughs> you don't care about it. <laughs> No, Kyle does not give a shit about plants or flowers or anything like that. It'd be a waste of money. Have you ever asked? He me? doesn't think they're pretty or anything. Yes, I have asked you before. I have flowers. And you agreed. You said like, nah, you probably wouldn't. You wouldn't care. Same. And what about? Okay, a, no. What about a basket of monsters? Monster munch. Monster, Monster munch. munch. That's, that's What's much in the cupboard? That'll suffice. Yeah, but I've my own private stash next to my desk. You come in here, look what you've done, Harry. So, was Charlotte your Valentine's then? Um, technically, but we're still friends, so. It's a vibe, right? I don't know who's getting the short end of the stick. <laughs> I feel like it's. Definitely not Charlotte. I took, well, I took, it, to, I took it to Nando's for, for tea anyway, so. You. I took Carl to McDonald's. Oh yeah. What'd you get Abby for Valentine's Day, Carl? A local sandwich. I'll cut it over. Oh, back is for skin. Put it on the vice. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's just, it. it's just a good mole, bro. <laughs> this looks good. Oh, no, it's hard. Hi, no. friend. Enough of your conversations now. Would anyone like to play an era? Yes, please. And no more talking. I can load it up. You go play an era. Mm, what, what if you lose an EHB? Yeah, XP waste. I was gonna say. I know. 
I went myself off. I've done quite a few, quite a bit lately. But what if someone's watching? They'll know. Who? Your clan? I don't know. The police. Oh no! Clan. The police. Which one? <laughs> Valiance or Clue? Could be either. Wait. Right. We'll queue quick, and then we'll we'll, we'll meet up. And then we'll he fucking peg. went without us. Everyone pegs the person to their left. <laughs> what are you lot laughing about? Well, can you peg a girl? Um, you can do a penetration though. That's right. That's you, not can do a, you can do a what? Um, <laughs> you can do a, do a penetration. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> that is double. Use your own. That's not pegging. That's just anal. No, I think he's suggesting multiple, like a train. But I might be wrong. Oh, Aatrox, I can't play that. Seek by the ladder leading to the Dagonoth King's room. <laughs> Very <laughs> fun. <laughs> That's a thumbs down from me. A N E A N T O I A N E. What's your birthday? And that's my 1500th clue. Got four Dark Claws, Jav Darkness. 19 Elites in the end, pretty decent. I should have expected more like 13. So that means I'll be opening them after all the hard clues. I did give the Rogue Chests a go in the Woody, but the problem with that is just, it's far too busy at the moment at least. So eventually in the end I just went back to doing Scatizo. Didn't get the Dark Totem unfortunately, so that does leave me one more collection log slot with Skatizo. So I will find myself back there in the future either doing Slayer or doing more hard clue stacking. So with all these hard clues when I open them all in one day that means I'll get rank 2 for the day. So it's just a small little achievement. Kinda cool. Alright thanks for watching. I'll see you next time when I open up all these hard clues. Have a good one in a bit.